excuse me, sir. Question for you. What is the best piece of advice that you would tell your younger self? You're going back to high school or college. What would you say? Oh, that's a good one. Um, I think the best advice I could give anybody is stay true to yourself and have a great integrity. Wow. That would be the best advice I could yeah. give anybody. Right, just a couple last questions. Yeah. What industry did you pursue a career in? Restaurants. Are you yeah. a business owner? Yeah, I'm a partner in a restaurant. Yeah. So as an entrepreneur, what would be your best piece of advice to someone wanting to start a business in 2022? I think that uh, hard work, work ethic is right. going to be part of it and then be well financed. Yeah. And have an idea you totally believe in and support. What has been your biggest challenge like being a business owner in the restaurant industry? Well, there's a lot of challenges being in the restaurant industry, but the, probably the biggest one today is just employees finding the right people and it's been difficult. A lot of people um, don't want to work too. No, I don't know about that. I think there's still plenty of people who want to work like you guys or whatever you're working on. Absolutely. And I think that I you know there's a lot of entrepreneurial people out there. I think it's just a good idea, hard work and uh, have a good business plan. What has been the best financial decision that you made throughout your career? Investing in real estate. How long have you been for, investing in real estate Since for? 1984. How many properties do you currently? I have several properties, but I've never, I mean, if you can hang on to the property, and never overextend yourself, you're probably going to do great. And what I mean by that is don't buy something you can't afford during the down times. Right. Hang on to it. And over time, I do believe real estate is going to be a good thing. How do you know? I guess like what would be your advice to someone looking to invest in real estate? And how do you know when it's a good time to buy and like when you should make that investment? Oh, I think those are just follow the market. I think the market, what I mean by that is just follow Obviously, if you can buy low and sell right. high, that's a wonderful formula, Absolutely. but that's not reality. I think it's just hang on to the property. Yeah. You know, you guys are young guys. You're going to have a long time to buy a house. Absolutely. 30 years from now, I guarantee it's going to be worth more than it was or any property, any of these buildings. Yeah. And last question for you. From what you've seen throughout your career, whether it's a certain skill set that people should obtain or just a mindset or like an attribute when going out into the real world, how can someone become wealthy in today's world? You know, how can someone become financially free going into 2023? I'm going to put it back to hard work. I think that obviously you got to look around and see what opportunities are provided for you. But I think work ethic will trump everything.